Hello everyone. In this video, I'm going to show you how to write a SQL query to get the nth highest salary in a table. Okay, so we are given this employee table having the salary column. We are supposed to find the person having, uh, let's say, the fourth highest salary in this table. Okay, so there are a lot of methods to achieve this. I'm going to uh, demonstrate a couple of methods. So if you are aware of any other methods, please do let me know in the comment section. Okay, so this is the data we have. Okay, so if I take this data into an Excel sheet uh, to show you just like, I mean, uh, the fourth highest salary, right? So if I sort this, so you can see that, you know, this Ramesh Kumar has the fourth highest salary. So we need to get this uh, fourth, uh, I mean, write a SQL query to get this record as an output. So let's see how to do that. Okay, so the first method that I'm going to show you is by using limit and offset. Okay, so let's see how to do that. What I'm going to do is I'm going to write uh, select star from employees. I'm going to order it by salary and I'm going to call uh, uh, order it by descending. Okay. So if I run this, what happens is you will get the highest salary first and you know, the data is sorted in the descending order. So now uh, this is the record we need, but how to use limit and offset. So what you, uh, as you might know, what limit does is it will just uh, limit the records uh, that in your output, right? So if you put five, it will just output the five records. Okay. Now how, what is, what is an offset, right? So what offset does is it will start printing the output start uh, from the out offset that you give here. So if you say offset four, what it will does, uh, it will do is it will print five records starting from offset four. Now, what is offset four? Each record has an offset. So first row will have an offset zero. This will row will have an offset one. This one has two, three and so on and so forth. So if you run this query, what will happen is it will order the data by uh, salary descending and it will print out five records starting from offset four. So let me just run you the, uh, run this query and uh, you know, show it to you. So if you see here, it uh, printed you five records, but this time it did not print the highest salary because it started printing from the offset four. Now using this logic, what we need to do is we just need one record. Okay. So if you see here, what we need is, uh, let me just insert a row here. So if I, like I said, offset right so this one has offset zero this one has two and so on and so forth okay so now this record the fourth uh is right? it will have an offset of three now to get this record what we need to do is we need to put limit one and uh, when we put limit one it will just give one record and offset as three okay so that it will output only this record so let's see if that works okay let limit one and offset three so if i run this query now if you see here, it, you got the Ramesh Kumar ID and the salary as a 3000. So this is the guy who has the fourth highest salary. So this is one method to do it. So let's see another method to do it. Okay. So in this method, what we are going to do is, uh, let me uh, write a query. Okay. So I'll say select testing salary from employers order by salary and i'll say limit four okay i'll, I'll show you what happens uh, let me run this query first okay so now now i have this for okay i have to order it by descending okay so now so this is the record so i got four records uh top four records having the salary right so now what we will do is we will select the last one in this so you can select like i mean uh ascending as so what we will do is select minimum of salary okay from this sub query so i'll make this as sub query so let's see what you get here okay uh, i just needed to alias this sub query okay let's run this now so i got this 3000 so now what we will do is we will filter out we will apply where condition from this table so what i'll do is i'll apply select star from employees where salary in i'll just put this value so we have uh, just 3000 here so when i put this filter what happens is So we are just putting where salary in 3000, right? So basically this entire subquery calculates to 3000. So let me run this query. So if you see here again, we got Ramesh Kumar here. 
So uh, that's the uh, second method. There are a lot of methods again to achieve this. These are just a couple of methods that I just demonstrated you. If you are aware of any uh, better approaches to you know, solving this problem, please do let me know in the comment section below. So that's it for this video and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you and please subscribe to my channel.